Hey everyone, Josh here with Fresh Start Customs, and today I'm gonna to be answering the most asked questions since upgrading to version 2.0 and we create software, and that is how do we get this image back on the right-hand side for auto-selecting the settings and fill engrave? Um, if you don't know, in the original version 1.05, it would show up all the way on the right-hand side here. You could select like 150 speed, 100 power, you'd click this square, and it would auto fill in the settings. I'm gonna show you guys how to do that again. So just for an example, we're gonna be using this basic wood, basswood, and three millimeter wood. If you don't know how to get to this screen, just make sure you have nothing selected on your board first. Click over here and you'll get to this screen first. And then you'll select your material. So we're gonna just go with this basic material first. We're gonna click confirm. And then now this is where the actual magic is gonna happen. As you can see on the right hand side, it's not showing up here and it is a fill engrave. You gotta make sure it's on fill engrave. And all you have to do is use your mouse wheel or your trackpad and scroll down. So this was hidden. I didn't know this was here, but you click on it and it works just like it did before. So like in the example, 150 speed, 100 power, I'm gonna click on that and it automatically changed my settings back up here to that for the fill engrave. Um, this, this card doesn't exist for regular engraving or cutting. Those are just the pre-cut settings for that material. But for a fill engrave, you just scroll down. Right there it is. Hopefully that answers your guys' questions because I had troubles finding this too. I had some help from a fellow admin in the We Create Users group on Facebook. I'll add a link down below. His name's Jim. Super helpful. He runs the group with me. Um, but other than that, I hope you guys have a great day. I hope this helped explain that, and we'll catch you guys later.